Kansi's consort room was from bordered yellow banner, Ma Jiaqiwan. We don't know when she came into the inner court, but considering she was the first imperial woman who gave birth child for Kangxi, she highly possible came into the inner court before the Empress Xiao Changren, or they came into the inner court at the same time. In 1677, Kangxi first time wildly promoted his imperial women. Ma Jiashi was promoted to Rongping, the imperial concubine Rong. In 1681, Kangxi promoted the noble consort Tong to the imperial noble consort. Meanwhile, he promoted four imperial concubines to the consort. Those four imperial concubines were imperial concubine Hui, imperial concubine Yi, imperial concubine De, and imperial concubine Rong. Those four consorts were considered as Kangxi's most important consorts. In those four consorts, the consort Rong was the fourth, but. She and the consort Hui got the right to help the imperial noble consort manage the inner court. In 1667, the consort Rong gave birth to Kangxi's first kid, Cheng Rui. In the following ten years, she gave birth another four boys and one girl. Unfortunately, during those six kids. Only Kangxi's official third son Yin Zhi, and Kangxi's official second daughter, the Princess Rongxian, grew up. In Kangxi's early life, the consort Rong definitely was one of Kangxi's most favorite women. But Kangxi only loved her for ten years. In 1722. Kangxi passed away. The consort Rong moved out from the Forbidden City and stayed with her son Yin Zhi. In 1727, the fifth year of Yong Zheng's time, the consort Rong passed away and was buried in Kangxi's consort's tombs. Yin Zhi was born in 1677. He was Consort Rong's youngest kid. When he was born, the Consort Rong was the imperial concubine, who were qualified to raise kid. But Yin Zhi was raised by the government officer Chu Erji, because Yin Zhi was studious and versed in literary arts. He earned his father's favor. In 1698, the the third the thirty seventh years of Kangxi's time, Kangxi promoted Yin Zhi to Cheng Jun Wang, the Prince Cheng of the second rank, because of Yin Zhi's military contributions. In August 1699. Kangxi's favorite consort Min passed away. According to the rules, Kangxi's sons were not allowed to cut hair in the following one hundred days. Maybe Yin Zhi didn't think the consort Min was an important imperial woman. Two months after the consort Min's death, Yin Zhi cut his hair. Kangxi was furious and demoted Yin Zhi to the third rank prince. Even worse, because Yin Zhi's behavior humiliated the consort Min, consort Min's biological son Yin Xiang started to hate him. In 1709, Kangxi promoted Yin Zhi to Chengqing Wang, 
the Prince Cheng of the first rank, because in 1708, Yin Zhi told Kangxi that Yin Zhi required some lama to curse the crown prince Yin Rong. At the very beginning, Yin Zhi wasn't eager to participate in the throne competition. But with Kangxi's oldest son Yin Zhi and the crown prince Yin Rong lost their powers and were under home arrest, Yin Zhi became Kangxi's oldest son with first prince title. So some government officers guess Yin Zhi had possibilities to inherit the throne and started to support him. In 1722, Kangxi passed away and Yong Zheng became the emperor. Yin Zhi was the only prince who was older than Yong Zheng and had the first rank prince title. Meanwhile, as Yong Zheng's favorite little, little brother, Yin Xiang was given lots of powers. Under this situation, Yin Zhi definitely couldn't have a happy life anymore. In 1722, Yong Zheng ordered Yin Zhi to remain at Kangxi's Jingling, using the excuse that Yin Zhi was closely affiliated to the crown prince Yin Rong. Two years later, Yin Zhi's heir, Hong Sheng, lost his title because of wrongdoings and became Xian Shan Zhong Shi. In 1730, Yin Xiang passed away. Yong Zheng felt extremely sad. Because of the bad relationship with Yin Xiang, Yin Zhi didn't express very sad. After Yong Zheng heard of Yin Zhi's reaction, he was furious. So, Yong Zheng stripped Yin Zhi's title and had Yin Zhi and his family members confined in Yong'an Pavilion. In 1732, Yin Zhi passed away in Yong'an Pavilion because of sickness. Yong Zheng allowed him to be buried using the second rank prince standards. Thank you for watching this video. See you soon.